Here we are with Alanga Makabu, who Saturday night takes on the Noel McKellen for the WBC Cruiserweight title, trying to regain the Cruiserweight title. We're about 24 hours away. How are you feeling? Thank you very much. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling great to be here in America. Back for, for, for my title again. I lose it uh, in the beginning of the year, and um, I'm here to get it back because... I'm ready for it. How excited are you? You know, like you said, a lot of times guys lose their title. They may not get a title shot for two, three years. Like you said, you're getting a title shot right away. Uh, how, how excited are you for that opportunity? And did you think that, that it would come this quick? I'm, uh, what I can say is I was ready to, to fight because when I lost my title, I was having a rematch between me and Badu Jack. But Badu didn't want to fight me and uh, the, the title was vacant and uh, that's why I'm fighting the mandatory. Noel Mikael he been looking for me for a long time. He was mandatory this two years and he got his year and I'm here also to fight for the title and I'm, uh, I'm ready for it. What can you tell us about Noel McKellen? How, how do you describe him as a fighter? Uh, he's a good fighter. I cannot say he's, uh, he's a bad fighter. To be mandatory is not easy to his day, and uh, but he don't have that experience I got. I'm quite sure I'm going to win my title, and then he he will stay for a couple of days to be a champion again. I, uh, I in fact, you were just answering my question. You've been a long time champion. You've fought a lot of the big names in the cruiserweight division. How important is experience? You know, being at the world championship level like you have is going to be important in this fight. Uh, you know, to to win to win a world championship is a problem, and to protect it also is a problem. And uh, I fight a good uh, couple fighter, uh, so good modern Mikael. And uh, it's a mandatory, I cannot say he's a bad boxer. He's here to fight Junior Macabu and let's see what he got. But what I know is to write a story, to be again the second time world champion, WBC, and to make proud of my country and to make proud of Africa. One question about the Jack fight. Was this just a bad night for you? Just not just a, a bad night and we will see the fighter that we've seen in the past uh, on Saturday night? Okay, uh, you know, uh, any fight, any things can happen in the fight. You can lose, you can win, you can draw. And uh, I got nothing to say about Jack. I was not uh, active uh, for full year. And uh, that's what I can say, give like a reason. But right now, I was back in the gym and I'm here to write a story again with Dunking Production. What do you uh, want to say to the fans in closing? What do you want to tell them out there what they're going to see Saturday? Live on fight.tv, donking.com, pay per view. What I can say is thank you, Duncan, for a chance for bringing me a second time in America. And I come to buy the story with Duncan because I was also surprised to see Duncan writing a story in my country when it was signed with. Uh, and the judge for him and ask myself how did that happen in the public democratic of Congo that me also I can do something. I can write a good story. That's why I come as I am to and today I'm proud to write a story in America because I have the dream and I can be big. My name can go big in America. Junior, we wish you best of luck. We'll see you Saturday night. Thank you very much. And uh, I just want to say something back to Mexico, to my friend Canelo Alvarez, who, who challenged me some years ago. He faced me and my people who have been working, waiting to see that fight to happen. He was going to challenge me like a cruiser. Right now, I'm going to win my battle, and I'm quite sure Canelo must be ready to face me. Because my people have been waiting. He's a superstar at the world. I'm quite sure he's not going to give uh, no shit. He's not going to keep quiet. to not say anything, any time, any death, any way I'm fighting. Thank you. Well, we wish you best luck. And uh, should you become victorious in Saturday, we'll look forward to hopefully that fight with Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.